Hey guys, so I've had the Dremel DigiLab 3D45 for almost a full 24 hours now, which of course means I've used it quite a bit. I was so excited to get this machine, and I wanted to resist the urge to spend every waking moment with it, but I conveniently am taking the day off today, so I spent quite a bit of time getting the machine going, and now jumping into the software and familiarizing myself with everything that the machine can do. And just as kind of an early impression, I've gotta say, I love it. And of course, as you'll know, I kind of expected to, but regardless of that fact, every print that I've done on it, and so far I've done two prints that were built onto the machine, onto the SD card or the uh, flash memory, they both turned out amazing. And now I'm printing something, a design that I quickly whipped up. The software for this machine is essentially Cura. It's all based on Cura. It feels very much like just regular Cura. And that's actually kind of a step in the right direction for me because the software we used with the 3D40 was something from Autodesk and it was a little limiting, so I'm happy to see this. And more importantly, it outputs G-code, so that kind of has the gears turning in my head, making me wonder, is it possible that we could use some other slicers like, dare I say, Simplify 3D? Maybe if we could get the right settings? But even if not, at the very least, I'm happy to be able to use Cura with this machine. And right now I'm printing my third print on this machine that I just barely got last night. This print is something that I designed really quick, and I just wanted to go through the whole workflow of actually slicing something myself and getting it on the machine and starting a print. I'm also printing this in their Eco ABS. They sent me a couple spools of. This really isn't my review, of course. Uh, a few more videos are coming. One will be a little bit more review-like. This is just kind of early reaction, my experience so far. And just to sum it all up, I'm really happy and enjoying this machine. If you have any questions, let me know. Feel free to drop me a comment. If there's something in particular you'd like me to print or something you'd like me to test, some aspect of the machine or the software, etc., just let me know. And I'd be happy to do that for a future video. Thanks for tuning in and keep on making awesome stuff.